Alrighty, day something. It'll say on the screen right now what day this is. But we are on day seven of polish. We're gonna check it out. I think we're done. We should be done anyway. Hand this over to you, thank you. There we go. So day seven. Okay. I believe. <laughs> Of polish, anyway. I think you're right. Think. See, there's the P. Polish drum. P for polish. Can't understate how nice it is to have a uh, mm. polished drum. Mm -hmm. Thank there you. you. Mm -hmm. The, uh, I know we've talked about it before, but the aluminum oxide will kill grass and weeds, so. That's why it hangs out. We do this in our driveway because we need yeah. to do that. <laughs> Once again, you see the P for polish on the back of the barrel. Yep. Pardon the uh, intrusion. Looks like we got a little. <laughs> Why is it flying? <laughs> Come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. How do they feel? Feel super smooth. I bet you we got a good cop polish on it. And we're going to rush on inside and finish rinsing these and take them out back to show you because uh, we have some daylight. Daylight's yeah. a wasting. Okay. All right, so we're chasing the sunlight a little bit. See, look at that. <laughs> All right. Dun, 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 dun. You tell me how to angle it. Well, let's go right there. The idea. All right, now we, we switch dry sides it. with you so I can see the glare and we'll dry it. And see if we got the candy coat look. It should look like it's wet. Drum roll. It's dry. Drying. Just so they know I'm drying it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Focus. Oh, yeah. Look at that candy coating. Can you see the screen? Yeah. Look yeah. at that. Yeah. Let's see the other side. Nice. A little bit of spalling on the edge, but not yeah. too bad. We got some cracks in there. We could have tumbled all that away, but... All right. All right, I'm dying to see the amethyst. Okay. <laughs> Never tumbled amethyst there before. There it is. So that's what it looks like wet. It should look like that dry. Yeah. <laughs> and we haven't even burnished them yet. Nope. That's the beauty of this is this will get all the remaining grit off too. Uh -oh. There's areas sure. with it. Yeah. Shiny, but. Oh, that's a good, that's a good polish on that it's edge. It's definitely got a polish, but the it's whole It's got thing, some spalls, man. Let's see the darkest side. Oh. Oh, there is no darkest side. Huh? There, there's your darkest side. <laughs> yeah. Hmm, not hmm. too happy with that one. Nope. It's but. okay. First time doing that. What about this one? Yeah, this one looks nice. like it's polished up better, actually. Oh, yeah. Got much more of a oh, candy yeah. coat on that. The edges are interesting, though. Yeah, all they're the, like bruised. The edges are all spalled. Ah. They hmm. definitely are bruised. We'll so. have to do some more investigating. Maybe yeah. we polish too long. Maybe amethyst. I don't know. It's this. It's quartz, so I don't know. I don't know either. All Let's right. take a look at some more of the quartz. Rose quartz. Yeah. I want to actually look at... Where did the piece go that I want to look at? This piece. So clear. Look at that piece. Yeah, that's Jimmy. Mm -hmm. All right, moment of truth. Do, 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 do. Holy cow. Can you see the screen? Look at that. Holy smokes. Yeah, we got the polish. Wow. 
And a little bit of rainbow effect in there too. And look, but you can still see just a little bit of pink. It's like a super, super light pink. That's awesome. Why don't you set it on the railing? Okay. And these will look better even after we uh, furnish them. Mm-hmm. But yeah, they, we got the candy coat for sure. Man, they're feels like glass, doesn't it? Yeah. That oh, well, that's the one we always pick up. <laughs> yep, and it's super pink. Is that dry already? Yeah. Wow. That's not even burnished yet. Jeez, let's see that side. Wow. Put that one on the, like lean it up against this one. There we go. Yep. And that was only seven days of polish, so. I mean, obviously we have some imperfections in the in the stones. Some of them came like that. You can see the fractures through there and everything, but you can tumble all that away. But <laughs> Our little itty bitty blue got a good polish on it. Is it the blue? <laughs> yeah, and it's dried already. Look at that. Wow, that's dry? Nice. Yeah. Sweet. I know. It's a little baby, but it got dried. It got polished well. Now let's look at the milky. Okay. That big old herbivore big, tooth the big old chonky with the cavities in it <laughs> <laughs> all right so what we've we had all already polished this one before mm -hmm. if you look back in one of our previous videos we had to add more quartz to the batch to uh make up for some volume that we lost can you see this one mm -hmm. i got a nice polish again here let me turn it towards the sun there you go oops now i'm in the shade there we go oops Hang on, sun's lower, there we go. There we go. Wow, mm -hmm. that's a good one, I'm happy with it. Yeah. I'm happy with the whole batch. Yeah, I can't wait to see these burnished. Yeah, I'm gonna do one more real quick. See how clear that one is? Mm -hmm. Can you dry that one for yeah, me? Yeah, of course. I'm happy. Wow. Let's see if I can zoom in on it. Wow, that's awesome. I see the other side. Sweet, you got some bruising too on it, didn't yep. it? Yep. Mm -hmm. The National Geographic Stumbler does tumble fast, and yeah. I think that's what's causing some of the bruising. And of course, remember, we've also been remarking that it's been a little, sounded a little weird. Yeah. So I wonder if it tumbled a little tiny bit off kilter. Could be. Yeah. All right, so we're going to take these and we're going to burnish them for a little bit. About 30 minutes, just to make sure all the, ooh, look how dark that one is. Can That's you, pretty. Can you try that one? <laughs> just to make sure all the grits off of them. It will actually give them a little bit bigger, a little bit better of a shine. Oh man. See the sparkle in there too? There's some sparkle inside. Oh yeah, there. yeah. Yeah, see that? Wow. That's cool. That one came out nice. Can you hold that up to the sun and we get behind it and see if I can't shoot through it? Ready? Let's see if I can actually focus on it. And I cannot focus on it. I can't focus. Ah. <laughs> oh well. So yeah, right. we're going to burnish these for a little while. About 30 minutes and we'll take a look at them after, uh, after that. But yeah, all said and done. Cool. I think we got it. Alrighty. P for polish. It's a half hour burnish. Look at all that soapy soaperness. Oh, here, let's turn on some light. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> that helps. <laughs> I know we, we say it every single time, but uh, the burnish between stages for us has worked really well. Yeah, it's super important. Look at that. It's not that bad this time. No, this is the polished grit. Yeah. Which is great. But it was still a little, there's a little bit of grime there. Yeah. Not a lot though. In addition to helping get rid of all the grit, it helps clean your barrel between stages, which is really nice. And then we always put a little water in it, yep. put a seal on it. Store it like that. All right.
because it is evening, we will not be going out on the porch again because the last of the sunlight we caught in the previous part of this video is now gone. <laughs> that last 30 minutes made a huge difference. <laughs> so we are gonna set up over on our table. And we'll see you there in a second. All right, can we start with one of those amethysts again? Sure. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. And yay, it's safe to dry them off now. Yeah. <laughs> While Mary's Didn't take that off, yeah. let's take a look. Hmm. That's super beat up, man. Yeah, it's crazy bruised on the corners. Like, when we say that, we mean like the edges. They're yeah. just bruised up. Yeah. And I think it's due to the speed that I the agree. tumbler's going. The National Geo... The version that we have is really, really fast, and everybody says that. Yeah. So I think it's just bruising the rocks, then banging around in there. Yeah, see, because look, on the flat edges, you've got a nice candy coat. Yeah, we got a good polish on it, but, yeah. Show them what you want. This is what I was going for. <laughs> like, I'm a huge uh, amethyst nut. I love it's true. amethyst ever since the dark crystal. I've, uh, I've loved the amethyst. And that's what I was going for, you know? A polish like that. Obviously, the quality of the quartz that we were using is not that. But, man, I was really hoping to get a nice, clean polish like that. But with the bruising and everything on this thing, yeah. I think that might also be because we were, we've were we been remarking that it was a little uneven. And I really am betting that that was part of it. Yeah. So it may be time to retire the old Nat Geo. <laughs> Might be, yeah. Well, well, we're mounting the vibratory tumbler now, the Lotto, so I think that's going to be good. These this are the... Is, these are the two. Yeah, we took these out. They, they fractured off of, One of our these. two pieces. So we took them out because I didn't want to lose them. So they don't really have a polish on them. They've got a, like a little luster, but like a matte finish. But at least you can still see the stripes. Is that the other one? Yeah, also... Banged Just up. Beat up. Wow. Yeah. We're gonna have to send these through again. Yeah. Make them smaller and just to get some polish on them. Yeah. It's okay. But you know, that's what you do. This is how you learn, and this is a great indication that our tumbler is uh, maybe it's swan fast. songing. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so fast. But I mean, we still got the polish. We just bruised the heck out of everything. It's just interesting that it's the amethyst and. You know, like, look at this piece of rose quartz. Wow. Yeah, just a few little dinks on, like, the oh, dairy so corner. See the camera. Wow. See that? We definitely got and the yeah, polish. But we got a little bruising on the edges, but not near as bad as on the amethyst. Yeah. So I think that, you know, every tumble is a good tumble because even if it doesn't go well, you learn something. Mm -hmm. And I think the thing that we have learned <laughs> is that we need to get that we need to get that vibratory tumbler mounted and going. <laughs> yes. Which we're working on now. Can you hold it down here? Sorry. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Can you see? Wow, that's the one. Puddin always wants to drink <laughs> when we're doing a video. And of course we're right next to her water. Yeah, we definitely got the polish on there. Holy smokes, man, that looks yeah. great. Can you see the screen? Yep. Wow. We'll set that one out. It's a good, nice, dark, kind of dark, pink, which I like. Some of these in here are really, really clear. Like these Almost one. white. Yeah, let's take a look at that. Like if somebody said, this is rose quartz, I wouldn't believe you. <laughs> but let's see, can you see the screen? Let's see if you can see the polish on there. There you go. Wow. Yeah, that came out nice. Yeah. Oops. There's a little bit of bruising on there. But... Yeah, there is. Not as bad, though. Not as bad as the poor amethyst. <laughs> yeah. Here's a super clear one I want to dry and look at. Focus. There we go. Wow. Man, they look really cool, though. I'm just glad we got that candy coat and that, that was seven days of polish all right there we, there go. we go nice yeah so we're gonna dry all the we're gonna go through 
dry them all off and then we'll be right back. All righty, we dried everything off. Yes, we did. And all in all, not too bad. What do you think? Not too bad. Yeah. I think we got a good polish mm -hmm. for sure. We're just a little bummed out about the, uh, the bruising that happened on some of them, not all of them. Yeah, this one looks great. That one does look good. It I think the smaller the pieces, though. yeah, mm -hmm. it does have some, doesn't it? Yeah, it has bruising and spalls. Yeah. Oh well, that's okay. Nothing says we can't polish them again. This one I think is one of the ones that turned out the best. Yeah, we almost always grab that one to look at. Yeah, that looks really nice. That's a mirror finish on that thing, holy mm -hmm. smokes. And this is all done with a rotary tumbler. We didn't yeah. use the vibratory yet. But we were just talking, Mary mentioned we should maybe throw these in the vibratory tumbler. Mm -hmm. See if we can edge off some of the bruising, polish yeah. it off, get everything a little, looking a little cleaner. Yeah, see what kind of polish we get. I really like this one a lot. It's neat looking. I don't know why I like it. But... <laughs> and that side is wise because that looks yeah. like glass. It looks really good. Mm -hmm. So all in all, our friend, our little friend Noe's going to like them. Yes. We kind of did this for her. She's not little anymore, by the way. No. She's little to us. Because <laughs> we've known her since she was born. So she's going to stay little. Forever. <laughs> Stop aging. But, uh, yeah. I would say we did well. I like it. Is it wrong that I like this little tiny guy? No. That he has the little stripies in him. Yeah, we always you always end up with little tiny ones. We save them. Mm-hmm. Be good like in a fish tank or something like that. Nice little mirror finish. <laughs> so all in all. Not bad. Not bad. I think the polish is an A plus. Yes. Because we definitely got that the tumbler nuts so <laughs> mirror on there, that candy coat. But the uh, yeah, the bruising and everything. Yeah. Hold on for one second, I'm gonna get a piece that we didn't tumble. And uh, Compare so, so you can see it before and after. So that is a piece of rose quartz that we didn't tumble. So they all started looking like this. If we put it on the white background so you can see the pink a little bit better. And that is what we ended up with. So you can see the difference. Yeah. Pretty drastic. So that's why we're happy with the polish in and of itself. Yeah. When you start with something like that, yeah, and end up with something like that, not too sure, but yeah, big difference. So now we just got to figure out how to sl tumble slower. I think we're gonna have to get a lower time tumbler. A lot of people recommend those, they do tumble much slower, and we tumble at the slowest speed that the Matt Geo offers, <laughs> yeah, on all, all four rounds, too. Yeah, oh well, all right, but. The candy coat still applies, which is great. Yeah, it's a good one. I think we did well. All right, so we will see you guys on the next video, and it's probably going to be us mounting that uh, vibratory tumbler. Yes. Let's see if we can't get that done this weekend. See you soon. <laughs>